What's good, footy fam? It's your boy Rick Rock. Today we're here at Island Hut for some island food. What's up, Uso? First time here. Yeah. Never been here, man. I've been hearing a lot of good stuff about it, bro. Thank you, man. Straight bro. up. Thank you, bro. Hell yeah. So this is Toupe right here, the humble owner of Island Hut and his wife. Baby. <laughs> come here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Here it is. Operate the camera. All right. How you guys? Hi. There you go, guys. Right. So we're getting ready to eat. We're gonna check out the menu and uh, we'll be back. What I like about this place is when we came in, we were met with the humble owner, Bailey and his wife as well. So the wife's back there right now making different types of uh, food for us to try out and everything. So wait for that, guys. I'm excited. Dad makes his own char sauce. Uh, my wife makes her own barbecue chicken sauce. So all our char sauce, everything is? Everything is authentic, really, from uh -huh. scratch. So what did you guys do for the community, Uso? Uh, so uh, we started the Burlington Angels uh, Coalition uh, with Don Michelle and uh, Island Hut. And uh, we go around and feed the homeless, and we give them brand new sleeping bags, clothes, supplies, uh, toiletries, and stuff. So uh, we've got Salvation Army to open up their uh, their winter stuff, and we collect a bunch of the items next door. So after we grind, we can go check it out. So guys, here comes the, some of the food that they made up. So this is the lumpia. Yes, and then that's teriyaki musubi. Teriyaki musubi. Look how beautifully. Well, that's me, guys. Ooh, smells good. And also, this is our their lumpia right here. Fresh off the fryer. Oh, man. The aroma smells so good. We're gonna try the, the spam wasubi first. Fresh. Teriyaki. Here. Teriyaki spam wasubi. Alright, guys. Wow. Oh my goodness. The rice is perfectly cooked. The rice matter a lot, guys. In the combination of that, the seaweed in a freshly cooked spam. Fire. Mm. So we're gonna try this fresh lumpia, guys, right here. Okay? And they also have uh, sweet chili sauce for dip and garlic vinegar. Let's try this garlic vinegar first. Ooh. <laughs> wow, the flavor guys, and the crunch of that fresh, crispy, hot off the fryer, lumpia. Mm -hmm. Mm. Wow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Guys, so, so far we had the lumpia and the teriyaki spamasubi. 10 out of 10, no doubt about it, guys. Aww. So that is pork char siu, teriyaki beef, and then Hawaiian barbecue chicken. Oh my gosh. Thank you. And then this is our kalua pork. This kalua pork right here. And this is an extra plate of you can All right, thank you. Oh, look at that, guys. This is our Kahlua pork right here. Oh, my goodness. It smells like they just made it from their backyard. Ooh, that smells so good. And here, guys, this is pork chow su, uh, beef, and chicken right here. Big scoop of rice and their macaroni salad. Let me turn this around. Look at that, guys. Ooh. Let's try their pork char siu, guys. Wow. Mm. <clears throat> they make that sauce for it in house. Wow. Nothing store bought. Nothing store bought. And all the food that you saw on the plate. This thing is straight family recipe, guys. Wow. That's packed with flavor. A pork char siu. Mm. Look at that, guys. 
Look at that color. Just right out there, beef. The smell that comes out of that beef, guys. Mmm. Their macaroni salad. Oops. Mmm. This combination plate right here. All the food on there. Blends it all together, guys. That chicken. Grilled chicken right there. I think this is what? Close to like the huli huli chicken or something? It's their barbecue. Their barbecue chicken. Mmm. Guys, if you guys haven't been here before, I don't have here in West Bremerton. If you're from around this area, you have got to check them out, guys. It tastes like a um, backyard barbecue where you're really excited that your favorite uncles like mm -hmm. making the food. <laughs> wow, it does. Mm -hmm. It does. Look at that moist and tender. Okay, Kahlua pork. Uh. The fat that he has in there. Right there. Tenderizes the meat and it also adds flavor as well. Mm. Ali, how you doing over there? <laughs> how you doing, Ali? Good? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, so Ali's enjoying the food so much, she's pretty much speechless. You guys gonna make it to the festival? We're gonna have plenty, plenty. Um, when is it? August 21. Okay. 2020, but go get pizza at mall. Okay. By the way, everything in this plate. Mm -hmm. Thank you. From the lumpia to teriyaki musubi. Yes. Thank fire. You. Yes. 10 out of 10, guys. Thank Hands you. down. You're welcome. Thank you. Humble couple over here, guys. Um, the wife goes back there and cook. Uh, Bailey prepares the stuff as well with her. And man, they do get packed here. We happen to come here on Saturday. They just open as well. So cozy, so inviting friendly and the food guys the food phenomenal right Ali yeah it's really good Ali and I both agree that the food is two thumbs up we're going for another another bite of that awesome musubi guys there you go mmm mmm okay. mm. We can try to replicate this, just like this. It wouldn't taste like this at all. I know a lot of you guys out there are like, oh, it's easy to make. It might be. No, because I have to drown mine in sauce. Mm -hmm. right. It might be easy to make, but it ain't like Island Hut. We'll see you guys. Forget eating off that small plate, guys. I might eat off this big plate right here. Mm. You really tried, though. Mm -hmm. I tried refraining from eating from the big plate, guys, but I can't help it. This food are fire. Really good. 10 out of 10. What can I say? Mmm. Well. Mmm. Like I said, guys, if you guys haven't been here before, Island Hut in West Bremerton, guys, they've been open for nearly three years here in January coming up. You guys have got to try their food. It's delicious. Masarap. And what I like about their decorations as well, they represent um, the island of Guam. They represent the island of the Philippines. You know, different types of uh, stuff. The twelves are here too, as well. <laughs> and uh, in the corner over there, they have this uh, Lay's. Awesome, awesome, awesome place, guys. Very, very inviting. Immediately when you come in here, you feel like you're in an island, right? Use the smell of the food coming out from the grill back there. Second to none. I say hi, guys, to the, the camera. What's your guys' name? I'm Monk. Bella. Bella. Bella and who? Monk. Monk? Yeah. Guys, so they're back there. They were the one uh, responsible for all, all this food, putting them together as well. We're going to finish up this, guys. Um, I'd like to say shout out to all my tomorrow family out there, the Pangolinas, the Santos, the Cruises, the Guerreros, the Salases, the Valettos, um, the Castros. Guys, if I missed you, uh, I'm sorry. There's too many of you guys. Much love uh, to the owner, uh, Bailey, Dubai, and his lovely wife as well. 
they're very humble. Um, again, guys, come here, check them out, try them out, please, no fail. It won't disappoint. If you haven't yet, hit that like, like and subscribe to your boy Rick Rock Foodie. Stay hungry, stay blessed. Your boy Rick Rock is out of here. Peace. So guys, so, uh, we're walking right next door from the restaurant. Uh, Uso right here is gonna show me what they have here too for the community. Right, Uso. So, uh, so basically, uh, I teamed up with uh, uh, two women, two mm -hmm. ladies, real uh, community activists in Kitsap County and right. Bremerton area. Right. Uh, their name is Dom Michelle and Kimmy Siebens. And we started this movement and we've collected items, like uh, as you can see here, we've had donations from the community, brand new uh, beanies, gloves, uh, hand warmers, uh, uh, coats, jackets, blankets, brand new sleeping bags. $60 blankets that we just hand out to the homeless people. Wow, guys. We got socks. Oh, we got brand new socks. We hand this out every day on the regular. Uh, we got shoes, used shoes for them too. So uh, we ran through like a couple, like maybe six, couple hundred uh, brand new sleeping bags. But uh, we wow, just want to bring them in and uh, keep them warm and stuff. Guys, come on. Who else does this around the community, guys? School. You guys got to come support the yeah. Island Hut, guys. Roger. Roger. These guys are these guys are very humble people. Um, they support the community as well, guys. You can see, okay, this is no joke. All right, this is right next door to where they're at. Right there, guys. Thank you, brother. Enrique. Oh man, bro, I've been sure meaning to do you, this, bro. man. My pleasure. Thank you. Thank My you, pleasure Michael. to do Thank this, you. brother. Yeah, Thank for you. sure, man. Thank you. I love it, man. Keep on grinding, bro. Keep on doing what you're doing, right. man. And uh, you're doing great, bro. Just guys, wanna, yeah. Like I said, please, please. Yeah. Island Hut in West Bremerton, guys. Come Yee. support them. Thank you, All right, one more time. Love, bro. All Love. right. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Thank you, guys.